I'm Samuel Eastman, I'm 18 years old. This is my ninth year in a row coming to this camp, but my first year as a counselor. So I used to go to the boys camp when I was a lot younger, and then I grew out of that, so I had to come to the youth retreat. Now I'm too old for that, so I still wanted to come back though, so now I'm here as a counselor. Uh, I'm from Regalsville, Pennsylvania. I have nine sisters and a brother. No, my brother, he's too young to come to camp, but I'm sure I'm gonna make him, I'm gonna make him come here when he gets old enough and I know he'll have a good time. I'm Brendan Staley from Waymar, Pennsylvania. I've been coming here for four consecutive years now. I'm 16, I've, every year I've just enjoyed it more and more. I really love being with the brothers. They have so many activities, the physical activities are great. I really enjoy the waterfront activities, especially the sailing, but most of all I think I enjoy just being with the brothers. I would say Montfort is one of the best summer camps I've ever been to in my life because they have so many different activities. There's swimming, sailing, archery, shooting, which I always thought was really unique. Probably a big insurance hassle for the brothers, I'm sure. But I, uh, it's one of that would probably be one of my favorite activities was shooting, especially when I was younger. Uh, now that I'm a little bit older, I still enjoy it, of course, but I usually like to do more relaxing things like volleyball or soccer. Uh, I, there's really anything you, you want to do here you can do as long as it's within the rules. Um, well this is my second tonight. It's a bass about 18 inches. Wow. I earlier caught a 22 and 4 inch paper will say. Awesome. Awesome. Good job. Hi my name is Nicholas Ward. I'm from Norwalk, Connecticut and this is my fourth year of going to the Montfort Youth Retreat and it's been an absolutely amazing experience every year and it's definitely one of the biggest highlights of my summer like up to the, like the week preceding it i'm so excited to come because it's such a really good camp retreat really in in all of its aspects not just the amazing physical things they have here to do which are you know from archery and shooting to volleyball and sailing and water activities and stuff like that. Sailing is definitely my favorite and I really enjoy it. Um, but one of the biggest parts of the camp definitely is the order and the balance in it which I think is really important. There's a really good mix of physical, uh, mental, vocal and spiritual. Uh, we do singing we keep in shape with all the physical activities, which are really fun. And we really get an amazing example from the brothers who, whose example is just really amazing. And I've gotten to know them pretty well over the years, even though I only see them about once or twice a year. And I really look forward to spending time with them. They're really all amazing, each in their own way. Um, another thing is um, what we learn here at camp. Um, a lot of the brothers give talks to all the campers during the week which are all really well prepared and really um, edifying and instructive uh, about lives of the saints and different um, things about catechism and things like that. So uh, this camp, I just enjoyed it so much over the years and the physical activities they have for us here are unbelievable. They just have anything you can possibly imagine from baseball and basketball to volleyball to swimming, sailing, shooting, archery, you name it, they have it. Uh, most of all, I think I like volleyball, especially when it gets competitive and they've got an awesome court. I really enjoy that and I enjoy playing with my friends. My name is Patrick Seeley. I am from Northeastern Pennsylvania. I have been coming to this camp for three years, took a break, and I really wanted to come back. Being a little old though, I had to come back as a counselor, which was fine with me because it's really such a wonderful camp. I, I just, I can't get away from it, you know, starting with just all the physical activities from especially the waterfront activities, the sailing, my absolute favorite, but there's also shooting, um, game rooms, you know, even if it's raining, you can do those activities. Um, and then, more importantly though, there is the uh, spiritual aspect of this camp, which is the best. The, um, 
Most important thing, I believe, is the traditional Latin Mass is offered here, um, as well as the Rosary, Benediction every day, um, confessions are available all the time, and a really big thing I find in today's world is that it's being traditional Catholic, it's hard to find people who are like you. Most of the world is very different, they don't agree with you, but here you can come and you're with about a hundred people who all share the same beliefs and thoughts that you do, and I find that very very comforting and it's it really is a wonderful thing and I look forward every year to come back and be able to uh, experience that and the brothers here are amazing I really 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 love them they're they're very holy people they their 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 order is amazing and I, I just love hanging out with them it's it's really really a good feeling I'm Ambrose O'Neill. I'm 15 years old and have become, uh, been coming to Montfort for three years. Um, it's been a really edifying experience coming here and just being with the brothers between the activities, uh, the physical aspect with the sports, the waterfront, and just being out here. Uh, it's, just, it's just amazing. The religious aspect is also just a, a great thing, whether it's the being able to go to confession, the religion classes, um, being able to go to Mass every day, it's just, uh, and then also the brothers, uh, the, having all these brothers here, it's just really interesting seeing how they live, just living their lives for Christ. Another great thing about Montfort is that I've made uh, so many friends here, and I've kept in contact with them over the years. Um, it's always great to just come back after not seeing them for a long time and being like, hey, it's, it's good to see you again. Hi, I'm Alan Maynard. I'm one of the dads who volunteers up at Montfort. Um, I usually run the kitchen. Uh, I wandered in here 12 years ago. No, not really. Uh, my son went to the camp the first year um, the camp was located here. And after camp, he had such a great time. I said to Brother Thomas, is there anything I can do to help out? You say these things. And he said, yeah, can you cook? And I said, yeah, I can cook. Well, can you help us next year? Well, all of a sudden, next year came and I was here and with one of the other dads, and we were cooking for 85 kids. And we worked 12, 16 hour days, and we cooked what was there, and we had a blast doing it. And I've been back ever since for 12 years. Um, for me, it's interesting. I see the faces of these kids, and I say, I remember you from last year. Well, this is my first time. I remember you from the other kids camp. No, I'm, this is my third year in the oldest, older kids camp. I remember their brothers, I remember their cousins, they all look the same. I don't remember the names, but I remember the faces. And they remember me, they go, oh, you're Mr. Maynard, you're, you're the cook. I'm really an IT guy, but I cook for two weeks every year up here. Um, it's a great pleasure to cook for the kids and for the brothers. Um, it's a lot of work, but it's like a retreat, or at Labora. Um, during my regular work life, I don't get to go to Mass every day. Uh, if I go to confession, it's on a Saturday. If I get a chance to go and see with the Blessed Sacrament, again, it's after driving around and sitting in the car and hustling in and not giving the world enough time. It's, um, it, it's a great atmosphere. It's a great place for boys to be boys and to learn how to be men, to have some wonderful examples around them. Um, I have had the privilege of working not only with the brothers who are absolutely fantastic. Really? <laughs> it's really, it's hard work. It's great work. It's one of those things that's worth doing. Um, as I said, it really has the aspect of retreat to me in many ways. Um, I'm away from the world, I'm with the people who are the right kind of people. Um, I recall the story of a, an army paratrooper who was interviewed and he said, why do you like to jump out of planes? They asked, why do you like to jump out of planes? He says, I don't. I like to be around the kind of people who do like to jump out of planes. And I feel the same way with the brothers and the campers. I like to be around this kind of people. People whose lives are focused on Christ, because I got to get better focused. People whose lives are focused on others and, and, and really having a good time with life the right way. You know, as, as um, Hillary Bellick said, you know, in so many words to paraphrase him, you know, Catholics have more fun. And it's true, you can have more fun the right way. You can have more fun uh, because you can be joyful in God. You can be joyful in, in His saints, you can be joyful in His church. And um, so we, we, don't, 
we don't run around with long faces here. We, we, we come in with targets, bullseyes with holes in them. We, what's for dinner tonight? Oh, you should have heard us singing at mass. And it's, it's, a, it's a great place to be a boy, to be a young man. And um, I'll be volunteering here as long as they'll have me and until they have to put me in a wheelchair, I guess. Hi, my name's William Wolfe. I'm from Connecticut. Uh, I believe this is my fourth year coming. It could be something like my 10th, uh, but my sisters who came to, mo or, sorry, to Morningstar for a while, they, uh, they told me that boys are not as mature as girls, so they don't have a younger boys camp. <laughs> but, oh well, I would have loved to uh, have been coming more years because I've been having an absolute blast coming here. Um, but uh, yeah, no, it's been, it's been really great. Uh, if you'd asked me what my favorite thing was, the first couple years I probably would have said something like shooting, sailing, boating, uh, the canoe trip, the hiking trip. Um, but definitely, uh, sort of as I've grown up and, and coming here through the years, uh, definitely my favorite thing is um, just really the religious aspect of it, being able to sort of retreat from the rest of the world. Having the traditional Latin Mass uh, every day is just really amazing. Um, having the opportunity to go to confession, um, just uh, talk with the brothers, uh, eat, uh, talk over the table um, while you're eating lunch, breakfast, and dinner, um, talk with the priest that's here. Uh, it's been a really wonderful experience. So.